What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to the show. Today, what we're going to talk about is good old Gronk. Okay, let's see. Gronk gets traded from the Patriots to where? Wait a minute. Let me see if I'm reading this right. I don't have my glasses on. The Bucks. The Buccaneers, but Tom Brady's at the Bucks. <laughs> Let me tell you something, man. I didn't think that sports was going to get this crazy this year, honestly. Like, I thought Anton- the whole Antonio Brown. Let's look at it this way. Last year, Gronk was retired from football. Tom Brady was the quarterback of the Patriots, and Antonio Brown was on the Patriots, okay? Now, Gronk is back in the NFL playing for the Bucks. Antonio Brown is fighting Logan Paul, and Tom Brady is a quarterback for the Bucks now. I'm just, you know, I, I don't know what happened in the last, like, 10 or 11 months, but if you told me this last Super Bowl that that was going to happen, I would have called you crazy. If, you know, because last Super Bowl, he won. Not this past Super Bowl with, you know, um, the Chiefs and the Niners. I mean, the one before that when they played the Rams. He won. And then if you were like, oh, dude, did you know that uh, he's going to leave and Antonio Brown's going to fight Logan Paul and then he, they're also going to go to the Bucks with Gronk? I'd be like, dude, you're nuts. First of all, I think Gronk still has a lot of fuel and energy. And when a lot of athletes say they retire when they're that young, they're not really retiring. That's why I don't really take it as seriously. It's like when Floyd Mayweather sa- said it. When athletes are like 23, 24, they're usually just retiring because they're super stressed and they don't really know how to say it. So then they come out of retirement. It's usually really good players. What's crazy is like Gronk is such a good player that him retiring doesn't mean anything. He's not missing out because he's so good that when he comes back to the NFL, teams are going to want him like that. Like there is no, with Gronk, there is no missing out. He's going to have everything, you know, for him at all times. You know what I'm saying? Tom Brady went to the Bucks. Gronk was retired. Then all of a sudden, Gronk just goes, yeah, I want to play. Oh, and I also want to play at the Bucks with Brady. And because he's such a good player, because he has such good chemistry, and he has Brady's word, he's on. I think this is going to be a crazy season when Gronk plays. Comes out of retirement, plays with Tom Brady. I mean, I feel bad for Edelman, but that doesn't even matter at this point. I think that... I think this is good... I feel bad for Boston, the New England fans, but it is what it is. But it's not something we haven't seen. That's the thing. A lot of people are like, oh, man, I can't wait to see how Brady performs. And it's like Brady throwing a pass to Gronk. We all know how that goes. I mean, we've been watching this since 2011. It's like that's the thing about this that really, like, it not. I'm not going to say bothers me. It's a little, it's a little stupid. But, like, that's the thing that that I don't understand why people are getting so shocked about. Like, Brady and Gronk on the same team, I mean, we've been watching that already. So how is that such a crazy thing? I don't know. When I watch, it's going to be crazy. The only thing that's weird to me is seeing Tom Brady in a Tampa Bay Buccaneers jersey. That's the only thing that's weird to me. It's not that he's throwing to Gronk. It's not that Gronk came out of retirement. When he retired, I never thought he was going to stay retired. Never, not even once. I would talk about it with my friends all the time. Be like, dude, he's just retiring because he's like a little bothered by football. He doesn't come back anytime soon. We all know it. But um, what I'm what I'm really confused about is seeing, you know, Rob Gronkowski and Tom Brady in a Tampa Bay Buccaneers jersey. That's gonna be the weirdest thing in the world. Uh, good move on their end though. They're taking their talents elsewhere. Maybe the coaches and and the team will respect them a little more because, um, the Patriots. Uh, you know, there was a notorious beef with the owners and Brady and the coach and Brady. Everybody knows that. Belichick didn't even want Brady on the team like the last three years. And anybody that's saying he did is kidding themselves. That's why they lost the last Super Bowl. Because Belichick didn't want him on there. Okay, that's why they lost the Eagles Super Bowl. I'm from Philly. I'm an Eagles fan. It's like they wanted to get rid of that man a long time ago. And I remember when he left, Tom Brady was saying like, it wasn't even that I said that I wanted to leave. It was just more of like a, they never said anything to me. They never even told me anything. So I was just like, okay, I guess I'm out. Like, that's how badly they wanted him to go. But anyway, uh, I want to see how this goes. I can't wait for them to play. I can't wait to see Tom Brady in a Tampa Bay Bucks jersey. Make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. Tell me what you guys think, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.